This is a quick tutorial on how to track the views on your Craigslist ads. And you're going to need an image in your ad that's hosted somewhere on the internet that's accessible. And for this example, I'm just going to use a random one. And I'm going to create a go try this link that links to that image. That's how I'm going to start. So just create a name, Craigslist test, get it some tags so I can find it later. And I'm going to create a redirect link from one of my sites, anzefosite.com slash, I think I'll call it, uh, images slash computer for sale. And then I'm going to redirect to the image that I've got hosted on the internet somewhere that I'm going to display. I'm going to use this random one here from some site that has a computer image on. I don't know what site this is. And I'm going to go copy the image location, go back to my go try this page, and paste that in there, and save it. Okay, so now I've got this redirect link, and there it is, and I'm going to click it, and whenever that, wherever that link is, that image will appear. And I'm going to copy the link location, and I'm going to paste it into my Craigslist ad. So I've got this ad here, it's a test post, uh, I'm just going to put it up for a moment, and it says, check out my awesome computer, which is for sale for a lot of money, and there's the image that I just created, an example site.com image. Continue, go through the process, and so remember I viewed it once as a test and now it, it just came up again as the second time so there's two impressions on that image now type in my things here to continue through continue and it's posted so now I'm just going to pop over in my email and get the link come back and I'm going to paste it into a new tab, and here's the link to my Craigslist ad that I've created. And that's view number three. You see the image is there, and that's the finished Craigslist ad with my awesome computer coming up, being loaded off of that random website through my go try this link. So if I refresh it, you're going to see three clips. My test, the one that came up during the confirm process, and that one that just showed up right now. And so that's three views on that, that ad. So I'm just going to reset it, clear it out, start from fresh, and just test this again. Go back there and refresh the page. And there it is. I've got one view. That's the first person to look at my ad. Yay! Come over here, click refresh. And it sometimes takes a couple of seconds for the... There it is. Okay, so I've got my, my one view on that ad. So there you go. That's how you track how many views you have on Craigslist ads. And you can probably use this exact same technique all over the place if you're allowed to put HTML images or, uh, yeah, if you're allowed to put HTML images into any page, then you can use this technique. Thank you, and enjoy.